Hey YouTube, today I'm going to teach you how to create a Triforce brush or icon similar to this one, this one, or this one. Okay, to start off, you're going to want to make a canvas that is 200 by 200. <clears throat> Next, you're going to want to go to your background layer and add an alpha channel. Use the magic wand tool, click in the center, and press delete. Then you're going to select none. Next, you're going to take your lasso tool, you're going to go down to the bottom left corner, and you're going to watch these numbers that are up here. You're going to watch for 0, 199, and you're going to go up here to 100, 0, and back down to this corner, 199, 199, and then back to the beginning. Now you've got a perfect triangle. You're going to select feather by 10 pixels. Then you're going to choose your color. It needs to be a pretty bright color. In this case, I'm going to use a red. Then you're going to fill your selection with any brush. I made a custom one for this tutorial. Then you select none. Now you've got a glowing triangle. This next part, you're going to take your lasso tool and you're going to find the point 5100 and then you're going to bring it across here to 150 100 and click and then 100 199 and then bring it back to the top and now you've got a triangle inside your triangle now you're going to select invert select feather by 10 pixels select invert again and press delete and select none. Now you've got yourself a Triforce logo. Now you can save this as just a picture or you can make it into a brush, which is what I'm going to do right here. I'm going to go save as. I'm going to call this brush 3 <coughs> because this is the third one I'm done. And then dot G I H. And then you're going to go to your C drive, program files, GIMP, share, GIMP, 2.0, and brushes. Now all you have to do is click save. And then this box will pop up and it'll say save as brush pipe. And all the default settings are okay. So just click save. Now you can go into your brushes and click refresh brushes.